All right, third time doing this video because I don't know. I want to do it short, but then I realized I'm a rambling fucking idiot, so I decided to do a whole video. Um, unfortunately, I won't get the fucking YouTube short algorithm to fucking suck my. Anyway, um, shout out to YouTube short algorithm, which is a lot better than the YouTube algorithm. Um, so just peep this. I was having a conversation, right? I spent a lot of money on eating out, relatively speaking, anyway. I'm not spending Donald Trump money, you know, going to McDonald's, bringing everybody up, bringing all the homies to fucking McDonald's, uh, eating McDonald's three times a day. That's not the lifestyle I'm living, but I am spending a good bit more than I probably should be for my uh, my my money and my age. But peep this. Think about this shit for a second. You have three meals a day. Some people eat two. Most people eat two nowadays. You have at least two, if not three. You eat breakfast if you are a working class person or you go to school or something like that. Usually around 8, 9-ish p.m., give or take. So then you have between, let's say, a.m., not p.m., you have between, let's say, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m., 12 hours. If you snack your ass off, which is fairly expensive, you get a good wealth of snacks, or you eat two meals a day. I think part A of the reason I'm making this is because I think it's fucking ridiculous people say that they don't eat out. Because that means you're either eating the same shit twice in a day which is like hell to me i can't imagine eating the same shit twice in a day and then you go about eating that same shit over the course of a week which sounds fucking hellacious to me um or you are cooking two meals a day or you're cooking to account for two meals a day which is has to be expensive as fucking comparison to eating out every day i don't know how it couldn't be Especially somebody that eats, which I eat a good bit when I do eat. I don't eat a lot. When I do, I do eat a quite a bit. I'm just thinking in my head, like, the logistics of either saying I'm going to eat once between lunch and dinner and then just snack my ass off, or I'm going to eat dinner and lunch, or I'm cooking my ass off, which I'm I'm lazy ass when it comes to cooking, so maybe that's part of the problem. But, damn, that shit has to be... You, I, I, think, I think this... Some propaganda going around against eating out and the the uh, financial uh, lack of suave that comes with eating out. But at the same time, I'm like, bro, you can, you really, you say this to me in a, in a plain tent, in a plain test. You just list out to me how much you're spending on either your snacks or your meals. And then you just kind of multiply that throughout the week. Because if you're eating multiple times a day, I'm assuming you're going to have to do multiple week or multiple meals for the week. You can't just do one, I would imagine, once you're eating like a fucking... I, I don't know, like, I don't know, but I just, I can't, I can't, I can't compute it. it, it, it's propaganda going on against eating out, and while I don't think you should eat out the majority of any given week, which I do, and it's not healthy whatsoever, at the same time, I'm like, people just, as this like, one or the other, one end, especially one or the other, that's not feasible, in my opinion, especially if you're going to work, if you're going to work out, if you're going to things that involve being outside the house, and uh, you're gonna be out for multiple, you know, hours at a time. I just don't. I, th th there's so many things that go into this equation that just don't make sense. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry.